Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing my top Mother's Day gifts for under $25. And then at the end, I have a couple that are over $25. So, there's a little bit of something for everybody. And I really truly believe that it's not about what you give. It's just about the thought that counts, even if you write a sweet little card and mail it to your mom. Um, it, that's great and I know with these times I kept in mind I was very thoughtful and I wanted to support local business or small shops um, and I also wanted to keep in mind that we probably aren't spending as much as we normally would and so um, I hope that you guys find this helpful and I wanted to just say if you are like me when it comes to Mother's Day it's not a very pleasant day. I don't know what it is about it. Um, it just makes me mad. <laughs> and honestly, I just don't like Mother's Day. Anyway, let's either here nor there. But if you have a husband who is not very good at gift giving, I'm going to give you two suggestions. You probably already know what they are. But number one is be very, very detailed in what you are expecting and what you want so um, if you see any of these things that you may want for Mother's Day then send him the link that's in the description box and tell him this is what I want and if he's still like the type that just is not good with gifts even if you do that guess what girls you deserve it treat yourself and buy it for yourself um, because you deserve it you deserve something on Mother's Day, whether it's a gift. Maybe you're, maybe to you, a gift doesn't mean anything. Maybe it's just being able to sleep in and not have to cook or clean. So if that's what you truly want, let your significant other know that's what you want. And so, anyway, I just want to throw that out there because Mother's Day is kind of a tricky situation with a lot of women I have found. Um, and I just wanted to give you a little insight on how I feel about it. So anyway, if you're interested um, in my video, just keep watching. Let's just talk about the elephant in the room. My hair is short. Um, if you don't know, I wear hair extensions and well, we're not getting our hair done right now. So um, I had to take them out. So that's why I look a little different. <laughs> anyway, let's just get going. Okay. So as I was putting these things together, I realized that they're pretty much all my favorite things. And so I'm going to start with um, this. And just so you know, everything's linked in the description box below. So you can either A, order it on Amazon and have it shipped to your mom or shipped to you. Or um, you could do a curbside pickup um, for some of it. And then the other stuff you could just pick up at Walmart. Okay. So the first thing is this water bottle. We have all different brands of water bottles in our house. We have um, Hydro Flasks, we have Yetis, we have Arctic, we have ones from Target. And this one is called um, Iron Flask. I got it on Amazon and it's just as good as my Hydro Flask. So in its half the price and it's like the big 32 ounce one so I like to get these big ones because it makes me drink more water and so I think any mom would love this whether she works out whether she doesn't whether she, every woman needs to drink more water and so this is a really great idea and they come in so many colors and I think it's I would love to get it so I will link this and then I have another idea for this so when I'll come back to it in just a second um actually I'll just talk about it right now my next gift idea I think this is like $24 so just at the $25 mark um my next gift is one of these start today journals um whether you're a fan I have found there's people that are fans of Rachel Hollis and I have found there's people that aren't and honestly, whether you are or you aren't, I still love the idea of this. Um, you can pick these up on her website or Target. 
I will leave the ones from Target linked below because um, I don't think you'd get this in time if you ordered it from her website. So anyway, I just love the concept of it. So every day you're writing, um, it's so simple and that's what I like. It says, today I'm grateful for, and you write down things you're grateful for, and then 10 dreams I've made today. And you use this part as if these dreams have already come true. Um, and then the goal I'm going to achieve first. So you could be writing the same thing over and over and over for months if you're working on something. I just really love this. This is my second one that I have purchased. And it's just a way to be intentional. And any woman would love this. Um, to go along with that, they come, you can get these like really cute stickers. Like this Choose Joy one. And I just think these are so fun. And I'm going to link a couple of my favorite shops below for them. But they're so fun to put on your Hydro Flask. Yes, I know the kids are doing this. But why not have a cute little water bottle that says Choose Joy to remind you about that every day. I just think it's fun. And so I will, these ones came from Rachel Hollis. But um, I'll link some other shops below. And there's an Instagram girl that I love. Um, she has so many cute ones and then I love this one and it says smash the hell out of your goals And I thought I was gonna put that one on the inside of my book. So to go along with that it's like four to fifteen dollars. I love these um, Pens I just keep them in this little um, Plastic bag and they just come in all different sizes. They're called the um, Tombow twin tone you can pick these up on Amazon comes with a really fine tip, which I like to write with, and then a thicker one that you could doodle with or whatever. But I love to use these in my little notebook. It just adds something fun. I am all about detail, and so these little details make all the difference. And you could tie this up really cute with a bow, and I promise you that your mom would love it. Um, I don't, I can't remember how much these are, but I, I know together they're probably right at the $25 mark. So there is that one. Um, and then my next one is a cookbook. It doesn't have to be the Magnolia cookbook, but this one did just come out and I did pick it up. And I wanted to show you guys how I um, tied this really cute um, tea towel around it. This is an old tea towel, so it does not look good. But I tried to buy some new ones and my store was all sold out. So this is a Magnolia tea towel. Um, you do need a bigger one. And so if you're going to do this, I suggest buying one from her because they are so large. But maybe you have a favorite tea towel that you like and you don't even need to do that. But I just think it's a cute presentation. And um, if you want to go all out, I thought you could get like a cute mixing bowl you could plop that in there um and then maybe like some maybe if you we have this place here where you can buy pre-mixed like breads and cookies and stuff you could stick those in there or you could just get some cute um anthropology um measuring spoon i couldn't measuring cups and spoons i'll put that in there and look how cute that would be Again, over $25 because the book is $22 or something. And then the tea towel is $4. So this one's just right at $25. But I gifted these um, the last time the Magnolia cookbook came out. And everybody I gifted it to loved it. And they just thought the towel was really cute. And it's just something simple. Um, not a lot of thought, but who doesn't love Magnolia? Even if you're not a baker or you like to cook, this book is beautiful and it's a great decor piece I know but anyway okay uh, there's that one and keeping along with the book theme um, I think this is such a fun idea especially right now um you could give your mom her favorite subscription to a magazine um they're very inexpensive this one you can get um, the whole year for $20. So, I mean, that beats the heck out of spending $8 per magazine. But again, I love them. Doesn't have to be Magnolia. It could be do-it-yourself, 
Better Homes and Garden magazine or just the Better Homes and Garden one. Um, I'll leave a couple links in the description box you could check out to see if that's something you're interested in. But this is a gift that keeps on giving that your mom will get quarterly or monthly. And I just think it's kind of fun. Nobody really buys magazines anymore, I don't feel like. But these um, nicer magazines, um, they're not just like ones you read and throw away. I mean, I don't. I just think that they're beautiful. They make great coffee table books or, you know. So they're useful and um, a great idea. I love these leather earrings. Um, I didn't really have any in today. I guess I could have put these ones in. These ones are my favorite. They're little cheetah ones. Um, I like to get the smaller sized ones because... I don't want like I don't like I don't it's kind of like I don't like big sunglasses they just make me look silly so um but I love that they are so lightweight they don't hurt my ears which I am very thankful for because if they do I don't wear them um but she has so many cute um designs like these little white marble ones I don't know if you can tell there you go maybe um these honeycomb ones are kind of like a blue. They're so fun. And then these kind of leopard ones. And then she also carries these like metal hexagon earrings. These are really cute. I wear these ones all the time. Um, and I will leave her linked in the description box below. I believe she's having a 20% off sale right now for Mother's Day. But if not, she... Um, I worked with her on Instagram a few weeks ago and um, she gave me a code and I'll make sure if it still works I'll have that link then linked also and it's 20% off. These are already super affordable so you could get your mom a couple pair and um, get her you know you could get her these and a pair of these and stick them into that or you could stick them in with your journal like these would just be a great like extra gift um and again supporting a small woman business which i love you know this this is these are kind of just random things um that i would love to get and um any mom would love so i ordered myself a rose um quartz face roller and I, like I wanted one but I was gonna put it in this video but it hasn't come yet so I will put, put, put up a photo of it and um, but I wanted to talk to you guys about this Laneige lip sleep mask oh my gosh I every woman needs this um, it's not cheap it's around $20 but it's one of those luxurious little things that make your world go round um this one is the mint it's unfortunately the only one that i like i have the pink one too but it's too sweet but anyway i love this and any mom would love it so i was thinking you could put this together with one of those face rollers and i don't know about you but when i find something really good i want to buy them for everybody i know so i have um, these are the Gimme Beauty hair ties. As you know, I wear hair extensions and so it's very heavy and I need really good hair ties. And these are the best I've ever bought. And you can get them in all different sizes. You can get these really thick ones. And they give like your ponytail really super like voluptuous. Like it's like not one of those ponies that fall or fall, fall down. I can't talk today. But anyway, so good. And... You get a bunch of different ones. I will link them in the description box below. But everybody needs one of these. So this year I bought everybody I know these for Mother's Day. And then I'm going to show you what I'm going to give people for Mother's Day this year. Um, so the other another gift under $25 is a cute house plant in a pot. Um, I would love this. I'm sure it's kind of like better than giving your mom flowers that are gonna die so I love that but um I'm gonna pair this 
with this this year. Um, I will share these on Instagram when I get them. They haven't come, so I just used one of my old ones. But I picked up some of these gorgeous tea towels from Target. And I'm just going to wrap them around these amber bottles. This is Thieves Cleaner. I don't, I'm like not in the oils community. But I did have my mom buy me Thieves because I love to clean with it. And I've been watching on Instagram people using this to spray their plants down. So I thought these two things would make the cutest little gift. So that's what we're doing for Mother's Day this year. And hopefully the mothers in our lives will love it. But I also am going to give a couple of my girlfriends one of these. I ordered some really darling labels off of Etsy. I'll leave them in the description box. Um, and when they come, I'll show you guys on Instagram because they are to die for and so cute. Okay, so I think that wraps up all my $25 gifts. I've got to hurry because my battery's dying. But the next two things are from the same shop. She's not paying me to say this. She doesn't even know that I'm saying this. Actually, I just really think that these would be awesome gifts. So I'm gonna pop in a picture of letter ledges because I don't have mine hung up because I don't have any wear for them. But these are wood ledges that have a little groove here that you could put those little cards in or letters in. And I think this would be the cutest little Mother's Day gift ever. Um, again, over $25. And um, I'll leave her shop linked in the description box. And then you've seen this in my house a million times. But the same shop makes these. And I thought this would be a really fun um, gift for Mother's Day. Uh, any mom. Would love it you don't have to have the kids' name on it if you're have a big family but you could have their last name with the established date and if you order these probably within the next couple days you could get them by mother's day um but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed this i know it's nothing like crazy but um i just think that anything at this time is going to brighten any mom's day